the National AIDS and STDs Control Program under the Federal Minister of Health has raised concerns over the need for Nigeria to increase efforts to prevent mother-to-child transmission and pediatric HIV. The National Coordinator of the Program at a consultative meeting with commissioners organized by the U.S. Center for Disease Control and Prevention Nigeria says efforts to change this rhetoric depends on the level of commitment at state levels. Mugyo Thomas has details and will return with business news. Many countries around the world have been able to eliminate vertical transmission of HIV, but Sub-Saharan Africa still accounts for 90% of the global body of vertical HIV transmission. A very worrying phenomenon. This is a meeting between the U.S. Centers for Disease Control and Prevention and the Commissioners of Health in the 18 CDC supporter states and the FCT. The goal of the meeting is to strengthen states' leadership in managing HIV response in order to sustain progress already recorded. Overall, the project has been able to record about 90% viral load suppression in 19 states, including the FCT. 1.9 million people in the country have access to life-saving treatments, which could enable them live a productive life. The national coordinator of the National AIDS and STDs Control Program says there is still a major gap in the prevention of mother-to-child transmission and pediatric HIV, which she describes as a two-faced coin. CDC, along with the U.S. Embassy, um, has launched a number of HIV treatment surge initiatives with the states in the lead. That effort has been very successful um, to address mother-to-child transmission of HIV. The essence is to reduce the number of children that become positive and by extension it will reduce the work we have to do in addressing those that are positive. It's no longer a death sentence. It's like taking you know, your paracetamol and you're fine. So we strongly encourage, I use this opportunity to encourage all women, but also all men who are aware that, you know, of their status to ensure that their children right, uh, are able to get the drugs and so they can live a healthy, very healthy and very normal life. State commissioners pledged to work assiduously to maintain the sustained epidemic control in their states as NASCP promises to soon roll out a program with Nigeria at the center. Moya Thomas, TVC News, Abuja.